Today on Review This Thing, we're going to do a little field testing on the programmable elevation knob of the Burris Veracity PH. This is Adrian with Review This Thing. And if you have seen our videos we've done on the Saco S20, then you've seen us use this Burris Veracity PH scope. One of the things we definitely wanted to do with this scope is bring it out to the range and test out the accuracy of the programmable elevation knob. It's a pretty cool setup. Basically, you take the Burris Connect app and you input the information, your load, your scope height. You can also upload current weather data. Ideally, what's gonna happen is we're gonna range our target. You saw us use some Vortex range finding binoculars earlier. Now we have these loophole ones to test out. So you're gonna wanna stay around for that video as well. Subscribe if you aren't, so you won't miss anything. And I'll mention here, there's a head up display inside here that is pretty neat. It has a bubble level. It also shows you battery life. And then of course you can set it to tell you MOA, meals, or distance. I have it set to yards. So we're gonna range our target and just turn the knob to the distance that we are shooting. And in theory, it should shoot dead on. Now, the different thing here too with this turret, I'll point out is it's not clickable. So it just gradually turns so you can have those smaller yardage adjustments. We are using the Saco Powerhead Blade non-lead round. This is the primary round that we've shot out of this gun and it has continued to be accurate at 100 yards for sure. We just finished getting it, making sure it was zeroed at 100. It's a maybe a quarter inch right, so we're just gonna leave it and see what happens there. Robbie just ranged our target at 207. So I'm just gonna turn my little knob till it says 207. Take a shot. Well, I would say at 200 yards, 207 yards, it's pretty doggone accurate. Wow, that's, that's impressive. I don't know, every time we test out something that has the ballistic function kind of built in, it just impresses me greatly. Hopefully we'll continue to be impressed the further out we get. Robbie ranged us at 299 on this target. Let's see how close we can get. 300. So we're dialed up to 300 yards. Let's take this shot. Wow. So up and down again is dead on. It shoots a it shot a little right there. Of course, like I said, it was shooting a little bit a little bit right anyway at 100. So it's pretty impressive. Next to 400. So far, we've been just zooming right through these. So now we're gonna go to what we have ranged at 402. So let's dial it up. Hopefully it's as good as it has been so far. Okay, so there is our 400 yard shot. It's about an inch-ish high, still to the right. Now we got a target about 450. Let's see how 450 does. So well, there you go. Up and down is pretty, pretty well perfect. It's still right. It's not a whole lot further right, too bad than the other one. But again, it was a little bit right at 100. So I guess that just carries on out further and further. So there you have it. That is our field test of the programmable elevation knob of the Burris Veracity PH. One thing I do want to point out here is that we have this lab radar where we're able to measure exact muzzle velocity and put that information into the app, which ideally means it's even more accurate. You don't have to have a fancy lab radar. You can just use the information on the box, but if you have it, it's definitely gonna make it work just a little bit better. If you haven't already watched our Saco S20 Hunter videos, check those out and stay tuned. We are gonna have that review on those loophole binoculars coming soon. And if there's anything else you wanna see, just comment below and let us know and we'll see what we can do. But as always, thanks for watching. Hey, thanks for watching our Burris Veracity PH field test video. While you're here, watch a bunch of other videos, like them, share them, comment, tell all your friends. Follow us on Instagram, Facebook, TikTok, Go Wild. Also check out our holler store, head to our website, reviewthisthingtv.com and sign up for our website and check out our Amazon stores.